We met on campus at USU in the summer, and he had just gotten home from his mission. Oh, yeah, and he was in the card sure. office talking to mom and Nance. And I was going in trying to figure out my school stuff to switch over from BYU Hawaii. And I saw him, and we just began talking. Up, I ended up living with people that she knew from high school, and then from there, kind of started going on dates. And now we're here. On this I love her together. skin and then also her hair. The choices we make in the road that we take are his butt. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> yeah, no, I'm not. <laughs> I love Quinn so much and I know that he's the one for me and the one I want to marry just because I think before summer, towards the end of the school year, earlier this spring, we really came to a huge, a huge like turmoil. Something that it was okay, either we get married or we don't, or like I move on. But it was something that I was gonna have to work on, and something he was gonna have to work on to make us work together. Um, and it was a really big like it could have been a deal breaker. But I just realized like how much he did for me. I love Kari because she's really, truly, is my best friend. We've definitely been through things, but having my best friend there has made it easy to kind of work through things and change for the better for both of us. And it just makes it really easy uh, because I truly think of her as my best friend. I can spend 24 hours a day, seven days a week with her and never get bored. I will always be laughing, playing, having fun because she truly is my best friend. And so meeting Quinn that summer was seriously the answer to my prayers. And we automatically just hit it off. He's so sarcastic and so funny, but he really treated me like any girl should be treated by a true gentleman. And we just fell in love and it was just so easy to connect with him. And he just made me feel so beautiful that it didn't matter what color my skin was or things that had happened to me in the past. And so when we came up to the point of in the spring with something that was really hard that we both went through. It was, how could I not like help him in his weaknesses when he was there and he completely picked me up and was there for me in my time of need. And through this summer, we were just really able to work out things that I feel like if we were able to get through, then we can get through anything with marriage. And I am just so grateful for him. I love him so much. And despite things in our past that we've been able to work on, we have really come to become true best friends and I love him so much. So for you, Kari, I'm really, really excited. Uh, it's pretty crazy when you think about it that I, for me at least, that I get to spend the rest of my life and eternity with my best friend. That I'm always gonna be able to wake up and know that you're there and you're always gonna support me. And that's been a big help for me and uh, where we are in life always knowing that you're going to be there supporting me and loving me and always being able to have fun with you. And I just am, really can't wait to call you uh, Kari Taylor. It's going to be a great day and I love you. I'm so excited to be with you, Quinn, for not just this life but the next, to have so much joy with just one person like I can't even imagine eternity with you and I'm just so grateful that I found my best friend it's possible I love you <laughs>